Okay, guys and girls, this is Star Trek Fleet Command. Star Quip Server 191. Trying a little bit different tonight, using it on my phone to see if it looks any different. Okay, I had someone ask me some questions about some ships. So, we'll have a look. I should have sped this up first. Okay, okay. Alright, so we'll change the ship. Okay, the Frangi Devor. I think I'm saying that right. Okay, she's at tier eight. You can see you can do some upgrades, but I've been trying to get go through them. Okay, here's the reading of what it is at tier eight point two. I call it point two when you've already installed two parts or something like that. Okay. So we'll scroll through slowly so you can read. Hope this is helping you guys that are after this sort of information. No, we don't need to. Obviously, if you already got the ship, you would have read all that. I'm not going to read it, especially on my phone. It's too small. But I wanted to see if it came out widescreen, so that's why I'm doing it on my phone tonight. Because the iPad comes out square. Okay, next ship. The new guy. So, I want, this is 6.2 the way I call it. I want to upgrade the weapons, but just need some more refined parts. Okay, at the moment... It's seven point, oh, sorry, seven hundred and ninety-seven. We must well say seven hundred and ninety-eight in power. It's doing quite good. I've been out killing level thirty-three ships, Borg ships. That is. Here's the specs. Remember when you look at my specs that I've got the plus ten warp. So don't. You've got to take 10 off the warp when you're looking at mine, unless you've done the research. Okay, we'll scroll through the specs again. Give you time to look at it. But you can always pause if I'm going a little bit too fast. Okay. Again, I'm not going to worry about reading this. Uh, you can do that yourself, that's not a problem. Okay, next ship, I think. Oh, how about a, a Bortos? You want to see a fully tiered Bortos? See what specs are on that. So this is fully tiered, but you again, not only is the warp range going to be quite high, Compared to a uh, 10 extra compared to normal. Oh, wait a minute. Do you have to get out? And go back in. I might have to do this all again. Okay. This is a specs for the Bortos. Yeah, but so some of my research might be making these figures different as well being le level 43 i've done quite a lot of research as well which all you all know i only just turned 43 today but i'm actually older than 43 but the in game i'm 43 i wish that was actually my real age um So warp range on this is warp 
70. With the up plus 10. So it's warp, normal max warp on this would be 60. Without Scotty. Okay, so we might go back. Oh, we've got. Is this one maxed? Yep, this is maxed as well. We'll go back out just to make sure it locks in the specifications. Because I've got a funny feeling it doesn't lock it in. Okay, so we'll start from the top again. You know, read of all that. This was actually cheaper to upgrade than the Bordos, but it has less weapons. Okay. I might just do a quick go back over the other two. Just in case they didn't lock in. Because you can always fast forward if you don't want to watch it again. Better off just making sure it's right. So the warp range on this is 47. But I'm still in the process of upgrading this. It's what... Oops. Go back in there. It's only at tier 6.2. Okay, we'll do go back to the... A Ferengi ship, click on it, step out, step back in, okay, click on there, click on there, I scroll back up, I'm hoping also the qualities come out, I've also downloaded some editing programs so I can start editing on my computer and trying to make the videos a little bit better and a little bit more fancier. Um, because some people had commented that I hadn't done very good editing, but I'm only learning. Okay, what other ships might you want to look at? Well, I've got this one here, but he's not tiered up all the way yet. He's only at tier 7. At tier 7, he's 2.422. I think we might have to get back out. Hang on. See, it's not even showing it. Oops. Oh, wrong ship. It was this one, so it would have been right. Okay, scroll back down again. Okay. I hope this helps you guys. Okay. The jelly's not that teed up, so it's only at 5.2, so I don't know if you really want to scroll through that, but. Okay, so that was something that someone requested from me, um, some ship information. Um, next thing I wanted to show you guys, something that I'm having a troubles with, and that's my dailies. And also I want to show you what the dailies are for someone at level 43. Okay, so what do we get for this? Uh, 25 officer, 25k officer, so we'll claim that, and for someone at 43, a lot of this stuff is not quite good enough, really, what, that's 
one repair on my jelly. Okay, so we'll clean that. You know, the alliance tokens still seem to be the same for both of those. I remember when you used to do your dailies, it was it seemed to be a lot more better off than what you do these days. 25k there. How much we got here? 7,000 ship. But I've still got another one to claim on that. Now, this is one of my bigger issues. See here it's saying, when I was up in deep space killing ships, and as you can see here, I was killing ships. I killed 25 of them. I was killing 44, isn't it? But these two weren't there. They appear three, four hours after the normal dailies restart. So now I'm going to get back up to deep space and kill level 44 ships again to claim this reward. So I'm quite annoyed about that. It used to happen with my swarm. Now it seems to be happening with these guys. Hostile hunt. So mining... I mean... I had to mine 140,000 G4 to climb this. Which then you've got to refine that. Which I'll show you again, maybe by the time I do the end of the video, we should probably have enough to see what we get. Here's Miss Worms. Now, the ship's already maxed out, so these are just waste. And you don't really get much when you claim these on this little level. Um, scrolling down again, you've got a Klingon. I like doing them. They're helping me build my new miner so i definitely like doing these every day it's not much i like doing when it comes to the dailies they just feel like you're wasting time you're not getting much reward from it again about the only thing good thing of swarms is you get your tokens for your dailies but it used to be three lots, and now there seems to be one, other uh, two, and I'm hoping I don't get another one appear tomorrow morning, like the hostile hunt that took ages to appear. The mining of um, uh, silk is the same, even though I've upgraded. Well, so yeah, we're gonna go back up to deep space to be able to do these ones because they appeared after I came down from deep space to kill Borg and Swarm. So I was quite frustrated when that happened. Mm. And like I said, it happens every day. I have a video for yesterday, but it this, it crashed when I was trying to show you the, do this video yesterday. So, what happened there? So we'll claim the whole lot. So 15, not even 16 million in pastel, which when you've got to build things at level 43, 15 million, dollar, uh, 15 million pastel is absolutely nothing. I don't know what you could do with that. Nothing. Um, these are handy so you can 
get some new offices. And we've got that again. I haven't even collected the last lot because it wasn't... It's not something they seem to tear up. Got some missions there to do because it, most of these missions here, the warp distance is too far away for me to get to. So I just got them locked away until I can warp further. Um, yeah. Don't know what else I can show you to, because I've already showed you the upgrade. Um, yeah, I just wanted to show you at level 43 what your dailies are and what the resources that you get for doing the dailies, I think is pretty crap. But, um, what do you expect from this game? With the news I just found out today about this game, I'm very disappointed and, um, speaking scopely about it, things like what I've heard today should not happen in game. But I'll make a video about that later, and um, it won't be a video I like doing. But some things may have to come out. Okay, so that's my base. As you can see, I've been bothered shielding it. The um, if I can. How we try to remember how we do it now. Oh, here we go. Oh, my shields are up. Oh, okay. But I don't know why. 86 million in strength. It's quite strong. There's not really anyone here on this server that could take it out anyway. But at night, I like putting the shields up. Because if they attacked it enough times, they'd probably get through. So, it's always best to put your shields up anyway. Um, yeah, got some upgrades I'm doing. So, yeah. Um, all I can say at the moment is don't forget to subscribe, like, and hit that bell notification if you would like me to receive the new videos I'm uploading um and I'm tr like I said I'm, I'm trying to use a better video editing software instead of just doing it straight from my phone or from my iPad I've got the software down I've just got to learn how to use it so it might take me about a week um I'll probably have a little play tomorrow and maybe lucky and I might be able to produce one in it and see what happens um yeah I'll catch you later. No problem. Bye.